and just all of the kind of crazy moments down the stretch that uh, end in another loss? Uh, you move on to the next game. Uh, I know they protected their home court. Uh, we got to go do the same. Did you see anything uh, once the matchup switched a little bit, like they moved uh, Joker off of AD on the one end and then he wasn't able to guard him as much on the other end? Did, did you see things uh, switch for that and what were you guys trying to do to respond? Uh, we come out of ha halftime, we got a couple good possessions uh, with AD, Brian, pick a row. Um, and then they made a good adjustment and they kind of you know, bogged us down and um, you know, obviously scoring 40 points in the <clears throat> second half, uh, 20 and 20, that's not, it's not going to cut it. Uh, Austin, just to, to follow up on that, you, you hit a three to put you guys up 20 with 10 minutes left in the third quarter. From that point on, you guys only scored 31 points, uh, I guess, kind of, what, what did you see with, I guess, the adjustments they made, but then you guys also not necessarily executing or, or running your offense the same way? Uh, I'll have to go back and watch the game to, uh, you know, answer that, the honest answer. Uh, right now, I don't really know frustrated with the loss, uh, but I don't want to give you a wrong answer, so it's really it. Austin, you guys are a, a confident team, and you've been a confident team. Um, you guys have played well enough to, be, to build big leads now in both of these games and have struggled enough to, to lose them. Um, where, where is your, I guess, your overall confidence right now? Um, out of these two games, I know they say a series doesn't start until the team loses at home, but it, it feels like this is a big one today. Uh, yeah, I mean, obviously, if we win this one, we're, you know, got momentum going back home. Uh, but, you know, I don't think that changes anything the way we approach games. We, you know, <clears throat> can go back and watch the film on both games and see what we did to, you know, take command of those games. And then we can see what we did to, you know, uh, you know, in better words, to lose those games. Uh, so we'll have to go do that and, uh, you know, put a full 48 together. <clears throat> a bunch of you guys have talked to us about needing to stay vigilant against this team, kind of no matter what lead you have. It's not necessarily safe. What is What was the feeling like tonight in the fourth where, you know, it became something like a three or four point game and then it was just kind of trading buckets the rest of the way, just being in that hyper intense competitive nature for the final nine minutes of the quarter. What's that like? Uh, I mean, that's what you, you know, grow up to, you know, want to do in big games is be in those situations and, um, you know, be competing against, you know, a hell of a ball team and, uh, like you said, in, in, in crunch time and, you know, have opportunities to make plays to win games and, <coughs> um, you know, we just didn't make enough plays tonight. Uh, but, you know, I thought actually down the stretch the last, you know,